डॉक्टर पवन कुमार कंसल्टेंट कार्डियक सर्जन लास्ट टाइम वी डिस्कस्ड वेन टू डू एंजियो प्लास्टी एंड वॉट आर द इंडिकेशन एंड वॉट आर द कंट्रा इंडिकेशन फॉर एंजियो प्लास्टी इन कोरोनरी आर्टरी डिजीज आर्टरी ब्लॉक्स टूडे वी डिस्कस वेन यू शुड अंडर गो कोरोनरी आर्टरी बाईपास सर्जरी वॉट आर दो ब्लॉक्स इन कोरोनरी आर्टरीज विच विल अल्टीमेटली रिक्वायर कोरोनरी आर्टरी बाईपास सर्जरी सो देर आर सर्टेन इंडिकेशन ऑफ coronary artery bypass surgery if you you have coronary artery disease and uh, blocks are uh, multiple blocks and your angiography report says that uh, uh, you re- you require intervention so there are interventions are of uh, two kinds one is angioplasty one is a coronary artery bypass surgery coronary artery disease if it is extensive it is uh, you know the coronary arteries are uh, left coronary system and right coronary system in the left coronary system it starts from left main disease and then it uh, divides into left anterior descending artery which is on the front of the heart and supplies blood supply to the septum which is most important part of the heart in contractility and the back side is the circumflex artery on the right side it is right coronary artery which supplies the right side of the heart and sometimes both the systems are equally dominant are sometimes left system is dominant right system is non dominant or sometimes right system is dominant left system is less uh, dominant so depending upon the situation of dominance of the coronary artery system we decide which blocks are better treated by coronary artery bypass surgery so the indications of coronary artery bypass surgery in coronary artery disease are as follows number 1 if block coronary artery blocks are in left main left main means where coronary arteries the left system starts from so left main is a big vessel which divides into two so at the origin of the left coronary system if there is a block beyond 50% the coronary artery bypass surgery is preferable then comes the blockages in left anterior descending artery along with the circumflex artery if there are multiple blocks in the left system in the left anterior descending artery and circumflex artery and also with the right coronary artery uh, getting diseased so it is a triple vessel disease then coronary artery bypass surgery is preferred choice for treatment of coronary artery disease then if you have diabetes and the disease is diffuse in nature because of the diabetes then again coronary artery bypass surgery is a preferred choice of treatment thirdly if the vessels along with the blocks the vessels are 100% occluded where angioplasty is not possible or we have to do uh, take out those uh, blocks by a special procedure called as endarterectomy procedure where we core out the 100% blocked the lumina of the coronary arteries and we uh, create a channel to supply blood flow if that area of myocardium is viable then again and that with endarterectomy coronary artery bypass surgery is preferred choice then there is a case where after heart attack you have developed some complications like you have developed a valve leakage mitral regurgitation or you feel heart function has gone down uh, less than 30 percent with a triple vessel uh, disease again it's an indication that you will require coronary artery bypass surgery it is a preferred treatment of choice as compared to angioplasty because where he, we can deal with the valvular leakage we can do valve repair or replacement along with the coronary artery bypass surgery then there is a scenario where you have aortic valve disease like aortic valve stenosis or aortic regurgitation or concomitant disease of any other a part of the heart where you already have coronary artery disease and another disease there are two procedures to be done then it is preferred that you should undergo coronary artery bypass surgery along with the other uh, malady which will also require some kind of treatment so this that's the indication like if you have aortic aneurysm ascending aortic aneurysm along with the coronary artery blocks so you will require a coronary bypass surgery along with the treatment of Ascending aortic aneurysm. If you have any complications of heart attack, like left ventricular aneurysm, where left ventricle balloons out, 
that's where we will re require that uh, ballooned portion which is dead already uh, called as an aneurysmectomy, left ventricular aneurysmectomy along with the coronary artery bypass surgery. So these are the broadly uh, uh, indications where you are advised coronary artery bypass surgery along with the other procedures. So coronary artery disease requires expert opinion, expert understanding of coronary artery blocks and along with that we take a cons uh, proper uh, guidance what treatment is a preferred choice so that you can get the uh, total uh, guidance and treatment for life. Thank you very much.